Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, one of the things that some of you have asked me about um, the subsystem for Android that Windows 11 has um, is of course first of all will we get things like the Google Play Store and that is out of the question. Um, the partnership is with Amazon, it's the Amazon App Store that is actually giving you the apps for Androids. But that said, you can sideload, okay? It exists a possibility. So if you want to have your favorite app, there is a way that you can sideload an app within that Android subsystem to have it working. Now, uh, that said, and also some have, by doing a few things, got the Google Play Store also to work. Uh, but one of the most asked questions I've had in a few in the last few weeks about the Android subsystem was about tweaking it. Is there a panel or settings that you can play with it? And yes, you can. If you search in Windows 11 22H2 Android, when you have it installed, it has to be installed first, you will see Windows subsystem for Android settings, which is an app. When you click on it, it opens the panel with all the settings that are available to you. So um, you'll have the subsystem screen reader, you have the resources, you can choose the type of resources as needed or continuous, because a lot of the problems that some people report, of course, is the sluggish performance of some apps, and this is why you can actually change that. So continuous would help, of course, high performance graphics will help definitely and then you of course you've got the uh, diagnostics data you want to send data and so on you want to enable the viewing of the data which means it's going to save some of it to your hard drive so you can view what data is being sent or not um, and of course there's the uh, advanced networking to help some of the apps um, use some of the network resources and the internet better and so on. So there is a way to do this. And of course, you can reset all of that to the defaults. And if you wish that um, you want everything to restart from scratch, even the apps that you've used, you can click turn off. Turn off will close will um, uh, close all the apps that the Windows subsystem has and restart kind of the app freshly next time that you choose. So yes, there are some settings that you can play with. Uh, then, of course, on the left side, there's developer mode. Compatibility gives you uh, compatibility, compatibility with some of the keyboard keys. So if you wish to play some of the games, for example, you might want to have some of the keys kind of act like, um, you know, you have a, a, a gamepad or joystick to play with. And so you can turn on or off the different options here and of course once again you got a reset button and finally you've got the about which tells you um, the information about the Windows subsystem for Android that you have so yep you can check out all of these settings play with them try to get a better performance out of your Android apps in Windows 11 22h2 if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching